Hello EV fans, welcome back to EV's gallery. Hope you guys are doing well. From the latest industry updates to in-depth reviews of the hottest EV models, we are here to keep you charged with electrifying news and insights. So don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell. In the ever-evolving world of electric vehicles, Chinese EV battery manufacturer CATL has emerged as a pioneer with its groundbreaking Chinching supercharged battery. This remarkable battery technology is set to make its debut in a 2024 Cherry electric car. What sets this innovation apart is its foundation in lithium iron phosphate chemistry, a more cost-effective option commonly found in entry-level EVs, including Tesla's Model 3 rear-wheel drive. What makes it truly exceptional is its ability to supercharge, adding up to a staggering 400 kilometers of driving range in a mere 10 minutes. This achievement marks a significant stride forward in the EV industry. However, it's crucial to understand that while LFP chemistry offers affordability and is the go-to choose for base model EVs, it comes with certain limitations compared to the pricier nickel manganese cobalt chemistry employed in high-end EVs. These distinctions are vital for prospective EV buyers to consider. LFP chemistry's primary strengths lie in its cost-effectiveness and reduced reliance on rare materials, making it a more sustainable choice. It aligns with the growing demand for eco-friendly and budget-friendly EV options. However, it falls short when it comes to energy density, charging speed, and overall energy output, which are areas where NMC chemistry excels. A direct comparison between the two reveals significant differences in charging capabilities. NMC batteries can support 800 volt charging systems, reaching a peak power of 350 kilowatts in models such as Hyundai's Ionic 5, offering rapid recharging and enhanced convenience. In contrast, LFP batteries typically operate on 400 volt systems and are usually limited to a maximum of 150 kilowatts. There are exceptions, like the LFP Model 3, which can briefly achieve around 170 kilowatts on DC charging, but it still lags behind the charging speeds of NMC batteries. Another consideration is LFP batteries' sensitivity to temperature variations. They are more affected by changes in ambient temperature, particularly cold weather, which can result in slower charging times and reduced efficiency. This factor is crucial for EV owners, as battery performance in various weather conditions significantly impacts daily usability. LFP chemistry has gained popularity for its affordability and reduced reliance on rare materials in its construction. It is also considered a more environmentally friendly option. However, it falls short in terms of energy density, charging speed, and energy output compared to NMC batteries. Additionally, LFP batteries are more sensitive to ambient temperature variations, which can impact charging times and overall performance. To provide a more concrete example of the differences, current NMC batteries can support 800 volt charging systems, reaching a peak of 350 kilowatts in models like Hyundai's Ionic 5. In contrast, LFP batteries typically operate on 400 volt systems and are limited to a maximum of 150 kilowatt, although the LFP Model 3 can briefly hit around 170 kilowatt on DC charging. According to independent testing, the launch vehicle for CATL's new supercharged battery is a sedan under Cherry's Exceed Premium subbrand. This sedan is known as the Stara ES in the Chinese market or Xlantix E03 for export markets. It's worth noting that this vehicle is closer in size to a Tesla Model S rather than the Model 3 and introduces a fresh styling language with a more luxurious interior compared to previous Cherry products. CATL claims that its new battery can provide up to 400 kilometers of range in just 10 minutes, even at temperatures as low as minus 10 degrees Celsius. The battery's energy density is also high enough to offer 700 kilometers of driving range. Essentially, CATL is asserting that its new battery technology can deliver the performance of an NMC battery while utilizing the more affordable LFP design. To achieve these remarkable advancements, CATL has implemented several innovations, including a new cathode design that enables rapid response to charging signals. Additionally, a new graphite ring system has been introduced to create an expressway for current conduction, and a new electrolyte formula improves conductivity and enhances the transmission rate of lithium ions. 
The Cherry exceeds Terra ES, also known as the Xlantix E03 for export markets, exemplifies the remarkable capabilities of CATL's Chinching Supercharged Battery. With a driving range aligning with CATL's claim of 700 kilometers, this electric vehicle showcases impressive energy efficiency, consuming a mere 12 kilowatt hour for every 100 kilometers traveled. This remarkable efficiency is attributed in part to its sleek design, featuring a drag coefficient of just 0.205 CD, which minimizes air resistance and enhances the vehicle's overall energy performance. Chinese media reports provide further insights into the Xlantix E03's power and performance. The rear-wheel drive versions are expected to produce up to 230 kilowatt, translating to robust acceleration and driving dynamics. However, the excitement doesn't stop there. The dual-motor all-wheel drive E03S take things a step further by incorporating a second 123 kilowatt motor. This configuration not only enhances the vehicle's all-terrain capabilities, but also enables an astonishing 0, 100 km per hour acceleration time of just 3 seconds. These performance figures place the Xlantix E03 in a league of its own, combining cutting-edge battery technology with impressive power output. What's also worth noting is the accessible starting price of approximately 56,255 Australian dollars in the Chinese market. This competitive pricing demonstrates CATL's commitment to making advanced electric vehicles more affordable and accessible to a wider range of consumers. The Xlantix E03 represents a compelling option for those seeking a high-performance electric vehicle that doesn't break the bank. CATL's new battery technology is eagerly anticipated and will likely undergo rigorous testing. Unfortunately, full specifications for the battery have not been released for direct comparison with NCM equivalents. The Cherry Exceed Stara ES is set to launch before the end of 2023 in China, and its success may mark a significant shift in the electric car industry's viability. This technology could potentially become the next major milestone in electric vehicle development since the widespread adoption of LFP batteries helped reduce prices for entry-level electric models. CATL has also been active in introducing other innovative battery technologies, such as an ultra-low-cost sodium-ion battery, known for its fast charge times, and the condensed battery with a claimed energy density of watt-hours per kilogram, which CATL has suggested could be used in electric passenger aircraft. In conclusion, CATL's new Shinching supercharged battery is a promising advancement in the electric vehicle industry. By bridging the gap between the affordability of LFP batteries and the performance of NMC batteries, it has the potential to significantly impact the market. As the Cherry Exceed Stara ES is set to hit the market in 2023, it's only a matter of time before we see how this technology performs in real-world applications. So, this is all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed the news. Please let us know your thoughts in the comment section and make sure to subscribe to the channel. So, this is all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed the news. Please let us know your thoughts in the comment section and make sure to subscribe to the channel.